Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining me. I'm Cheryl. This is Your Journey Yoga. Hope you're just doing fantastic, my friend. I hope that your day is progressing in a fantastic way and it's just going to get better from here on out. Um, so a sun salutation progression today. I love these. They're, um, they're just almost meditative. Um, get lost in the motion. Get lost in your breath. Um, we'll flow from pose to pose to pose. A little bit faster paced, but not too, too fast. But if you do need to switch it up a little bit, absolutely yes, you can do that. All right, my friends. So a seated position. We're going to get warmed up a little bit before we start moving into those sun salutations. A big shoulder roll up and back and let those shoulders slide down and away. Close your eyes. Let's do that shoulder roll again. Make it big. Oh, and shoulders slide down and away. Bring the hands down by your sides. Sit up nice and tall. And as you exhale, lean your head to the right. And inhale back up nice and tall. And exhale, lean to the left. Inhale, head up nice and tall. Exhale and turn and take your gaze out over that right shoulder. Little tuck of your chin down towards your collarbone. Inhale and lift your gaze. One more time, exhale, drop the chin towards the collarbone. And inhale it back up, turn back to face front and turn and take your gaze out over that left shoulder. Little tuck of your chin. And lift one more time, a little tuck of your chin. And lift, turn it back to face front. Inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, release that right hand down, left arm up and over. Just sway in side to side. Mm, feels so good just to get that body moving. So if you're, you know, at the beginning of your day, oh, this is really the first thing you've done other than have a cup of coffee. Be gentle, be kind. If this is kind of your midday thing and the body's been up and going, you might not notice as many creaks and pops. Not as much tension and tightness. That body is amazing once it starts rolling. Ah, so good. Inhale, reach to the sky. And as you exhale, rotate to the right. Little top of your fingertips. Inhale it back to center. And exhale, rotate to the left. Little top of the fingertips. Inhale it back to center. And exhale, release those arms down by your sides. Let's turn and come up onto all fours. Coming to a tabletop position, hands are shoulder width apart, knees are hip width, core is nice and strong. Take a big breath into cow pose, tummy towards the mat. Lift your gaze, lift your sit bones to the sky. Exhale, hollow the tummy and chest, lift your spine, tuck your chin, tuck your tailbone. Mm, that feels good. Inhale it back to cow. And exhale it to cat. One more time each direction. Inhaling it to cow. And exhaling it to cat. Coming back to that neutral spine, just gently sway your hips side to side. Can be small, can be a big motion. Knees can be apart, knees can be together. Just sway side to side. Coming back to center, let's sit it back to child's pose. Mm, just a nice release. Hip flexors, nice little stretch for your quads, for those glutes, and that lower back. So our sun salutation, one breath, one movement. But really use your breath as your guide. You do not have to keep pace with me, or if you're doing it with somebody, whoever you're doing with, really find your pace and use your breath as your guide. Let's inhale up to a modified high plank, shoulders right over those fingertips. Exhale, crocodile down, press it through up dog. Tuck the toes, lift the hips to down dog. And let's just gently alternate bending knees, walk it out. Mm, big full deep breaths. As you exhale, let both heels sink. Taking the gaze between your hands, walk your feet in to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down. Inhale, reverse one dive up. And as you exhale, left hand down, right arm high, lean in and reach. 
Inhale, both arms come up. And exhale, other side, lean in and reach. Inhale, both arms come up. Interlace your fingers. Bring your hands behind your head. Elbows are wide. Take a big breath in. And as you exhale, gently close. Elbows around the ears. Draw your chin down towards your chest. Inhale, head up nice and tall. Elbows are wide. And as you exhale, lean to the right. Oh, keep those elbows wide. Just feel that stretch down the side body. Inhaling it up nice and tall. And as you exhale, lean to the left. And inhale it back nice and tall. Release your hands to mountain. Inhale, reach to the sky. And exhale, swan dive to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down, walk, step, or hop to high plank, toes or knees, crocodile down. Press it through, up dog. And exhale to down dog. We shift our weight to our left foot, right toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that right foot through. Left hand to the inside of the right foot, rotate your body and reach. Right arm to the sky, as high as you can reach. Find that breath. Exhaling and releasing that right hand down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Extend right leg to the sky. As you exhale, sweep that right foot to the outside of the right hand. And again, once again, rotate and open. Now with that knee open, just a bit a little different stretch through the groin and through the hip. Gently release that right hand down. Sweep it back. Right leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog, holding your down dog, or inhale it to high plank. You can always just hold down dog, crocodile down, toes or knees, press it through up dog, and exhale to down dog, shifting your weight to your left foot, I'm sorry, your right foot, left toes to the sky, exhaling and sweeping that left foot through, right hand to the inside of your foot, rotate and reach. Oh, extend out of the shoulder through the tips of the fingers. As you exhale, release that left hand down. Sweep it back. Extend left leg to the sky. And this time as you exhale, sweep that left foot to the outside of that left hand. Toes turned out. Rotate once again and reach. Letting those hips be heavy. Stretching through the groin, through the hip. Exhaling and releasing that left hand down. Lift your hips, sweep it back, and extend left leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog. Holding your down dog or inhale it to high plank. Crocodile down. Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Taking the gaze between your hands, walk, step, or hop to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down. Inhale, reverse one dive up. And exhale, pull the hands to heart center. Inhale, reach to the sky. And exhale, swan dive to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down, walk, step, or hop to high plank. Toes or knees, crocodile down. Press it through up dog and exhale to down dog. Shift your weight to your left foot, right toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that right foot through. Left hand to the inside, rotate your body and reach. Right arm to the sky. Exhaling and releasing that right hand down, lift your hips, sweep it back. Extend right leg to the sky. Exhale, exhale and sweep that right foot to the outside of that right hand. Rotate and reach. Exhale, release that right hand down. Sweep it back. Extend right leg back to the sky. And once again, let's sweep it through between the hands. Back heel to the mat. Stand tall to warrior one. Oh, back heel pressing into the mat. Arms overhead or those hands are at heart center, long and strong through that back leg. 
Circle the arms to the back. Release your hands on either side of your foot. Lift your hips. Sweep it back. And extend right leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog. We inhale it to high plank. Crocodile down. Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Here we go on that left side. Left toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot through. Right hand to the inside of your foot. Left arm extends to the sky. Exhale and releasing that left hand down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Extend left leg to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot to the outside of that left hand. Rotate and reach. Oh, nice stretch for that hip. The groin hopefully getting lesser and lesser intense. And more satisfying, releasing that left hand down. Sweep it back. Left toes to the sky. This time we come back through between those hands. Back heel to the mat. Stand tall to warrior one. Breathe. Back leg long and strong. Outer edge of that back foot pressing into the mat. Circle the arms back. Release your hands on either side of your foot. Lift your hips. Sweep it back. And left leg to the sky. And gently release it down. Holding your down dog or inhale it to high plank. Toes or knees. Crocodile down. Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Back to that right side. Right toes to the sky. Exhale, sweep that right foot through. Left hand to the inside. Rotate and reach. Exhale, right hand comes down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Right toes to the sky. Exhale, right foot to the outside of that right hand. Once again, rotate and reach. Hips are heavy. Exhale, hand comes down. Sweep it back. Right toes to the sky. And this time we come through. Back between the hands. Back heel to the mat. Stand tall to warrior one. Find your breath. As you exhale, open to warrior two, hips, chest, and shoulders open to the side. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little, and then exhale, sink. Windmill those arms down on either side of your foot. Lift your hips, sweep it back, and extend right leg to the sky. And gently release it down, holding your down dog or inhale it to high plank. Toes or knees, crocodile down. Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Here we go on that left side. How you doing? Left toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot through. Right hand to the inside of the foot. Rotate and reach. Lengthen and extend. Exhaling and releasing that left hand down. Lift your hips. Sweep it back. Left toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot to the outside of your hand, toes slightly turned out, rotate and reach. Hips are heavy. Feel that stretch to the inner thigh. Exhale, slowly release that hand down, sweep it back, left toes to the sky, and we're going to take it back through center to our warrior one, back heel to the mat, stand tall, breathe. Sinking into that warrior one, strong. On your exhale, open to warrior two, hips, chest, and shoulders open to the side. Gaze out over your front middle finger. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And then exhale, sink. Windmill those arms down on either side of your foot. Lift your hips, sweep it back, and extend left leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog. We inhale it to high plank. Crocodile down. How are you doing with those crocodiles? Press it through up dog. Each one gets us stronger. Exhale it to down dog. Taking the gaze between your hands. Walk, step, or hop to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down. Inhale reverse one dive up. And exhale, pull those hands to heart center. Just a little check-in. 
Close your eyes for a moment. Breathe. As you're ready, open those eyes. Take a big breath in, reach. And exhale, swan dive to forward fold. Inhale, up to monkey half lift. Exhale, down, walk, step, or hop to high plank. Crocodile down. Press it through, up dog. And exhale to down dog. Shifting our weight to our left foot, right toes to the sky. Exhale and sweep that right foot through. Left hand to the inside of the right foot. Rotate and reach. Exhale, right hand comes down. Sweep it back. Right leg to the sky. Exhale and sweep that right foot to the outside of the right hand. Once again, rotate and reach. Getting into those hips. Releasing that right hand down. Step it back. Right toes to the sky. And then we take it back through center to our warrior one back heel to the mat stand tall breathe take a big breath in and as you exhale open to warrior two hips chest and shoulders open to the side lengthen and reach to those fingertips inhale straighten that front leg a little and exhale sink now inhale, straighten that front leg. Open hips, chest, and shoulders to the side. Reach it out over those right toes as far as you can reach. When you can't reach anymore, right arm down, left arm high. Rotating that left palm towards the front, reach it up and over. A long horizontal line as best as you can create. All the way down that left side. Inhale, lift that left arm to the sky, and as you exhale, release that left hand down. Hand on either side of your foot, bend that front knee, back heel off the mat, sweep it back, and extend right leg to the sky, and gently release it down. Inhaling to high plank, crocodile down. Press it through, up dog. And exhale to down dog. And here we go on that left side. Shift your weight to your right, left toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot through. Right hand to the inside of the foot, rotate and reach. Exhale, left hand comes down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Left toes to the sky. Exhale, sweep that left foot to the outside of that left hand. Toes slightly turned out. Rotate and reach. Exhale, release that left hand down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot back through to our warrior one. Back heel to the mat, stand tall. Ah, uh, squaring the hips, chest and shoulders to the front. Pressing through that back heel, sinking into that right or that left leg. Breathe, take a big breath in. And as you exhale, open to warrior two, hips, chest and shoulders open to the side. Lengthening and reaching through the fingertips. Strong through that core. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And then exhale, sink. Inhale, straighten that front leg. Open hips, chest, and shoulders to the side. Reach it out over those left toes as far as you can reach. When you can't reach anymore, left arm down, right arm high. Really working to open the chest, to open the hips. Keeping that pelvis facing front, we rotate that right palm towards the front, taking that arm up and over right along the side of your face, reaching out and lengthening. Oh, find that breath. Inhale, lift that right arm to the sky, and as you exhale, slowly releasing that right hand down, one hand on either side of your foot, front knee bends, back heel off the mat, lift the hips, sweep it back and extend, left leg to the sky, and gently release it down. Taking the gaze between your hands, walk, step, or hop to forward fold. Inhale, up to monkey half lift. Exhale down. Inhale, reverse one dive up. And exhale, pull the hands to heart center. Inhale, reach to the sky. And exhale, swan dive to forward fold. Inhale, up to monkey half lift. Exhale down, walk, step, or hop to high plank. Toes or knees, crocodile down. 
Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Shifting your weight to your left foot, right toes to the sky. Exhale, sweep that right foot through. Left hand to the inside of your foot, rotate and reach. Exhale, right hand down. Step it back, right toes to the sky. Exhale, sweep that right foot to the outside of the right hand. Rotate and reach. Exhale, hand comes down, sweep it back. Right toes to the sky. This time we come back through center to our warrior one. Back heel to the mat. Stand tall. Breathe. Take a big breath in. And as you exhale, open to warrior two. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And then exhale, sink. Inhale, straighten that front leg. Open hips, chest and shoulders to the side. Reach it out over those right toes. When you can't reach anymore, right arm down, left arm high. Rotating that left palm towards the front, reach it up and over. Find your breath. Inhale, lift that left arm to the sky. And as you exhale, slowly releasing that left hand down. One hand on either side of your foot. Back heel comes off the mat into a runner's lunge. Bringing both hands to the inside of the foot. We're going to work our way down to lizard. You can stay right here or come down onto your left forearm. Perhaps the right. Find your breath. We come back up to the palms of the hands. One hand on either side of your foot. Lift your hips, sweep it back, and extend right leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog. Inhaling to high plank. Crocodile down. Press it through up dog. And exhale to down dog. Shifting your weight to your right foot. Left toes to the sky. Exhaling and sweeping that left foot through. Right hand to the inside of your foot. Rotate your body and reach. Left arm to the sky. Exhale, left hand comes down. Lift your hips, sweep it back. Left leg to the sky. This time to the outside of the hand. Sweep it over and rotate and reach. Exhale, hand comes down. Sweep it back. Left leg to the sky. Let's sweep it through to our warrior one. Back heel to the mat. Stand tall. Square in the hips, chest and shoulders to the front. Take a big breath in. And as you exhale, open to warrior two. Uh, lengthening and reaching through the fingertips. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And exhale, sink. Inhale, straighten that front leg. Open hips, chest and shoulders to the side. Reach it out over those left toes. When you can't reach anymore, left arm down, right arm high. Lengthen and reach. Rotate that right palm, reach it up and over. Long horizontal line. Beautiful stretch through the waist and through the ribs. Inhale, lift that right arm to the sky and slowly release it down. One hand on either side of the foot, bend your front knee, back heel comes off the mat to a runner's lunge. Let's bring both hands to the inside of the foot. And if it feels right to you, come down onto your right forearm. Left forearm, if you like. Lizard pose. And let's come back up to the palms of the hands. One hand on either side of the foot. Lift your hips, sweep it back, and extend. Left leg to the sky. And gently release it down to down dog. Taking the gaze between your hands. Walk, step, or hop to forward fold. Inhale up to monkey half lift. Exhale down. Inhale, reverse one dive up. And pull the hands to heart center. Beautiful job, you guys. Shift your weight to your left foot. Right foot crosses in front of the left. Big toe just barely touching the earth. Find your breath and slow it down. Start to slide that right foot up above that left knee. 
And if you like, begin to sit it back to our figure four chair. Oh, beautiful stretch in that right hip. Challenging that left leg. Chest stays tall. Breathe. Inhale, we rise. Lifting that right knee to 90 degrees. Extend those arms out to a T. And let's press that right leg straight back. Hinging forward to warrior three. As deeply into warrior three as you would like. Slowly pulling that right knee back forward. Pulling the hands to heart center. We extend that right leg, heel to the mat. Let's sit it back onto that left heel. Reaching those right toes down, or the right fingertips towards the toes. Stacking that left hand on top of the right. Breathe, a little balance, but a beautiful hamstring stretch. And inhale, pull the hands back to heart center. Lift that right knee back to 90 and set it down. Roll out the ankle, stretch the toes, get rid of the wiggles with the arms, clear your head of what just happened, and pull those hands to heart center. Uh, we cross that left leg in front of the right, big toe just barely touching, and begin to slide that left foot up above the right knee. That figure four, we can stay here nice and tall, or begin to sit it back. Breathe. So that sun salutation series got us all nice and warm. And now it's that challenge for the balance to really quiet it down, to really be mindful and present. We slowly rise, lifting that left knee to 90, extend those arms out to a T, and let's begin to press that left foot straight back. Hinging as deeply into warrior three as feels good to you. Now we really want to work to square that pelvis. So that right hip, or I'm sorry, that left hip really wants to lift. We're going to do our best not to let it. Breathe. And slowly draw it back to center, lifting that left knee back to 90, hands to heart center. We extend that left leg and place that left heel to the mat, sitting back onto that right heel. Most of our weight on that right leg, reaching down with the left fingertips, stacking that right hand on top of the left, lengthening through the crown of the head, and just feeling that great stretch down the back of that left leg. Inhale, we rise, pulling those hands back to heart center, lifting that left knee back to 90, and gently release it down. You feel that? Oh, yeah. R roll out the ankle, stretch the toes, get rid of the wiggles with the arms. And let's roll those shoulders up and back to mountain. Inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, swan dive to forward fold. Inhale, up to monkey half lift. Exhale, down. Walk, step, or hop to high plank. Toes or knees, crocodile down. Press it through, up dog. Let's open up those knees nice and wide and sit it back to extended child's pose. Beautiful work today, you guys. Lots of twists. Hopefully the body feeling super good. And let's slowly walk those hands back up. Sweep your feet around. And go ahead and slide on down towards the center or the top of your mat. And let's bring the soles of the feet together. Knees open out nice and wide. Taking a hold at the ankles, sitting up nice and tall. Really feel that length in your spine. And as we hinge forward from the hips, oh, keep that spine nice and long. Mm. So there's an intensity here as we work to draw those shoulders back and down and keep that spine long as opposed to rounding and hinging from the waist. So really lengthen and draw those shoulders back and down. Now let's go ahead and extend one arm and then the other. Keep that length in the spine. You can use those fingertips to kind of pull. Now we're just going to round it over. Different stretches, both wonderful stretches, but just different intensities. And let's slowly begin to roll it back up. 
uh, sitting up nice and tall. Let's open up those feet a little bit wider than the width of your mat and just round it over. Stretching through that lower back. Little tuck of your chin. Rolling it back up. And let's close those feet. We're going to bring the hands behind the thighs and rock it back. Extending those legs, soles of the feet to the sky. Knees are going to remain bent just a little bit, and we're going to open up those knees a little bit wider than the width of our rib cage. And we're going to work to keep the tailbone down and every vertebra as we reach up and take a hold at the ankle or the outside edge of your feet and gently draw those uh, knees towards the ground. Uh, dead bug or happy baby? Now release that intensity and just kind of rock side to side. Just a fun, nice little playful rock side to side. Mm, that felt good. I hope it felt good to you. Pulling those knees back together. Oh, just a nice little tuck. And we're going to lift uh, and draw the nose towards the knees. If you can reach down towards those feet, reach down towards those feet, take a hold anywhere along the outside of your leg and just use the strength of those arms to make yourself even tighter into a little ball. Now let's extend those legs and release the weight of the upper body down. Extend those legs just as much as you can. If you're able, flex your feet. Ah, oh, that nice stretch all the way down the backs of the legs. Use the strength of those arms to start to pull those legs in. You can bring your arms around behind your calves, lining your forearms up with your calves if you like. Use the strength of those arms to pull, drawing those legs in. Nice little pressure massage in that middle back, and then gently releasing the intensity. And let both feet come to the mat, and let both knees gently fall to the left as you extend your right arm out. And just rest your left hand kind of along the outside edge of that right thigh. Close your eyes. Now you can pull those knees in a little tighter if you want or let them be out and away from you a bit. Just find some place that feels really good. Releasing that left hand and let's roll it back and over to the other side. Left arm extends out to a T and we just rest that right hand anywhere along the top side of that left thigh that you like, knee, thigh, hip, whatever feels good. And breathe, slow and steady. So the time that we get to spend on our mat, you guys, ah, uh, precious time. Amazing how it can reset, can change our perspective, can change our thinking patterns, can change our breathing change our mood, change our life, you guys. It really is truly, truly amazing. I have felt it firsthand, and that's why I just want to share it with as many people as possible. I love, 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 love being able to be here for you. So thank you for choosing to show up with me. We roll it back to center. Use the hands behind your thighs and rock it up, or a safe way to just come up to a seated position for you. And we turn and come to easy pose. Sitting up nice and tall, resting your hands comfortably, close your eyes, and we're just going to take a moment to breathe. Hands can be wherever it feels good to you. Find your breath. Smile, feel a smile on your face. Feel a smile on your heart. Feel a lightness in your being. My wish for you, my friends, is a healthy, happy life every single day. Gently pull the hands to heart center. A slight tuck of your chin. A sense of gratitude and love as we bring our practice to a close. I am so thankful for you. Thank you for being here as part of my tribe, inviting me into yours. With light and love, I honor the spirit in you as I honor the spirit in me. And namaste.